as an individual contributor, you know, why, why should they be thinking about leadership in what they do today? Honestly, I think we all have both an opportunity and frankly, a responsibility to step up and take the stance of a leader. I mean, you think about companies and just the, the constant threats and bombardment from competitive moves and marketplace changes. It's we need to push leadership out into all tentacles of the organization. And that's probably speaking to a CEO and executives, but from an individual contributor perspective is there's so many opportunities for us to grow and get better. And the 13 principles aren't just for people who have a team of folks. They're not about how do you empower people? How do you, those are all kind of those external, almost like, you know, one-on-one, two-on-one from a school perspective. Those are the next level things. These are about how do you foster greater levels of patience? How do you understand and identify and connect with your values and what matters most? So I believe in all the 13 principles are as relevant for an individual contributor as for a Fortune 500 CEO. I mean, I talked about it in the opening where this is for for entrepreneurs, for teachers, for even people who want to be better parents or they're out there in the community trying to make change and enact change. So it really is for everybody from the individual contributor all the way up to the CEO.